going on everybody uh just wanted to make a quick little video about a much needed upgrade to my wade fishing belt from cca and i ain't trying to knock those guys or anything i really appreciate all the all the stuff they do for the fishing community and uh and i love to support them but uh let me share with y'all what i did i know um this weight belt here, I always had trouble with this rod holder here, always leaning real far to either side. I mean, really bad to either side to some points where the rod would fall out and it'd get it dipped under water and it just wasn't real sturdy. So if you have any kind of stainless steel bolts, nuts, and uh, washers laying around, I would suggest bolting them, at, you know, putting, it on, putting them on there as such. And all I did was I got a drill and I drilled them through and uh so i put the flush side on this side towards my back so i don't feel the the bolt sticking through and uh yeah make sure you get the drill and you drill it pretty fast through don't go slow because it'll twist that fabric up pretty good so just go pretty fast in and out in and out and uh bolt them on there tight and man it makes it pretty dang sturdy it doesn't really move too much and another thing i did i had one of these yak gears uh fishing holders for my kayak and I inserted it in there like that. So when I did also, you can see my mark, my markers right here. I found a position on the belt where I liked it and it felt comfortable. And I marked it with the marker in there. You can barely see it in there. And same thing on this side. Just so what I did here was I got some um, Velcro and wrapped it around so it fits pretty snug in there. And it doesn't doesn't move too good in there see it's pretty I mean it's pretty it's in there pretty good and yeah and I put that on it to give me an extra maybe about a foot up so the water the reel doesn't dip into the water so there you go I mean I love this belt it's my first waiting belt and I tend to keep it for as long as I can so I've been needing to do this for a long time and I finally got around to doing it so if I got any kind of extra stainless steel bolts and nuts and washers laying around Go ahead and give it a shot. It's a nice little project, and man, it works really well. That's as far as it moves. I'm telling you, you used to move way out here, way, I mean, leaning real bad, and it just wasn't nice for your gear if you're trying to keep it from falling in the water, getting dipped in the water, but I put that on there to extend it way out. So I'll show you what it looks like with uh, around my waist and how high that thing is on my back, that rod holder. So 